Hey guys, Josh here. <laughs> Michelle. And we are Adventures Ahead, and this is Cruise Chatter 77. 77. Wow. Nuts. Crazy. Um, What's the topic? Today's topic is, should you gamble in a cruise ship casino? Yeah. Now, this is kind of uh, one for us to try to be not biased about, really. Because we do gamble. Because we do gamble, and we like it, and we enjoy it. But I can understand the drawbacks, for yeah. sure. Um, first of all, my answer is yes. If you enjoy it, you should gamble in there. Um, and I think people should give it a try, especially if you're bored one day, put a $20 bill in, see what happens. And if you don't like it, then don't do it. Right. And there's other games that play <clears throat> other than that. Like there's the quarter machine, which isn't as expensive. You can, you can play, Michelle used to play that for a lot longer on money, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Um, also, some people think that, you know, there's also other bad drawbacks to having the casino on the ship. You know, the cigarette smoke and stuff, people. But we're not going to get into that right now. But we're talking about, like, should you just gamble in there? I have a different opinion. Go ahead. I think uh, if you gamble, if you go in with the mindset that you're not going to win, you don't have a gambling problem already. No, we don't. I know. If you don't have a gambling problem, you can. Oh, okay. If yeah, you yeah. go in looking, friends at, of WCW. Or whatever if you go called. in looking at it as entertainment that, and not as I'm going to get rich, I'm going to get rich. Right. Then yes, you could gamble on a cruise. Right. We always we when we go in, we look at it as man, this is going to eat up three or four hours if we can go that long. Sometimes yeah. it's not that long. But we've been in the casino up to six hours, and it's not like we're losing all of our money. Oh, no. Right, right. I mean, we have, we normally have a threshold of how much money we're going to lose. Right, Michelle? Yeah. For the day. Yep. And then usually when we're past that, we might, um, sometimes we might go over it a little bit, but it's nothing oh, crazy. Yeah. We set limits and we follow those limits. Right. And I know some people that, you know, we know some people that have, um, not set limits and went way over those limits. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know who you are. <laughs> and, <laughs> um, no. <You're> an <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> That's what you get. Okay. So, anyway, um, you know, I think if, if you can have a healthy relationship with gambling, yes. you should do it. It's if you fun. want to. It's Some fun. people don't like to gamble because no. they don't like, they don't want to lose money. Right. And I get it. Now, don't we've had friends then. that just doesn't, they don't understand why we like to gamble. Or they don't like it. Right. Which is fine. They don't like it and they don't understand why you like to gamble. They, they're like saying, well, you're just throwing your money away. It's like, well. We're looking you, at it as entertainment. Right. We're looking at it as entertainment. And yes, it can be costly, but we've had, a, like some of our best times on a cruise ship have happened in the casino. That's right. <laughs> they really have. And when, and then listen, and you could be down a bunch of money, but when you hit that hit and hit a good amount, man, you're feeling on cloud High five nine. It. You're on cloud nine, man. So um, I know we're kind of like, you know, endorsing it because we do like it. Um, you got to do what's best for you, though. Now, some people talk about the odds like, oh, you don't win, you know, you, they'll pay out on the first couple days, but then the last days they don't pay out. I think that's hogwash. I do too. Because we've won some of our best wins were towards the end of a cruise. Um, so, uh, and I've won good on the last night of the cruise. So yeah. I think all that's hogwash on the machines and stuff. Um, I just think, you know, some people say that, but, um, and I've heard, you know, well, before we start gambling on a ship, I heard that a lot from different people um, that, oh, it's rigged. You know, it's rigged. It's blah, blah, blah. It's whatever. Um, Go on with an open mind. Yeah. And um, like I said, just set limits. Yep. And also just have fun. You know, it's a freaking casino. Don't sit there like this. I've seen people literally just sitting there with like, they look like m the maddest they've ever been in their entire life. Yeah. And they're like, <laughs> it's like, no, have fun. Or like the people like, <laughs> it's anyway. like, stop, you know, like have a good time, you know. Have a drink if you drink, or have tell a cigarette what, if you smoke. You tell know? us what you think, though. Yeah, let us know. Do you know. like to gamble on a cruise? Do you not like it? Tell us why. 
Um, yeah, we're just If you don't gamble on a cruise, do you gamble like in your everyday life? Like, do you go to a casino? Or do you buy scratch off tickets or yeah. whatever? I mean, maybe it's just something about the casino on the ship that you don't like. Maybe it's a cigarette yeah. smoke. Maybe it's whatever. I'm sure that's a lot of it. <laughs> and Michelle's in there adding to it. So, uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.